What are discounted cash flows? Discounted cash flows are the future cash flow projections in present terms. To understand the concept of discounted cash flows you can take a real life example. Let's say you have $10,000 in cash today and you want to invest it in your friend's business project which needs investment of $10,000. This business project promises annual cash flow projections for you. You are more concerned about when your investment is going to pay you back. By looking at the cash flows stream you are happy that you will receive 2000 in the year 1, 6000 recovered in 2 years and all your 10,000 recovered in 3 years. So by simple payback period you estimate to recover in 3 years. But technically you should not be very happy because it will take more than three years to fully recover your investment due to time value of money. Let us see how. Suppose that the discount rate of this project is 10%. To find out the discounted cash flows we need to discount these annual cash flows using the discount rate. In present terms you will be recovering your investment fully in approximately 5 years. Now you know when this investment is really paid back. This was one use of discounted cash flows to calculate the discounted payback period. From this point we can calculate the NPV of this project to assess that is this. Project worthy for you or not. To calculate NPV we use this formula. The sum of all discounted cash and flows is 10,115 less $10,000 as initial outlay giving us an NPV of $115. That means you have taken a wise decision. You can use discounted cash flows approach to value an investment within a company's stocks. Now let us apply this on the valuation of a company's share valuation. Suppose that you want to invest in smart company limited stocks. In stock exchange the stock is currently trading at $50 per share. Now to assess that the price of the share you can use the cash flows associated with the share. That is the periodic dividend payment of $5.8 per share indefinitely. An appropriate discount rate can be used as 15%. The projected dividends are now as per the dividend valuation method the value of this share should be close to $38.67 per share. It means that at current price of $50 share is over and fall in future to get closer to intrinsic value is fairly priced at $38.67 that the investment is not worthy for him. Just like valuing a share, discounted cash flows are also used to calculate the price of bonds for example US Treasury bills. Cash flows associated with T. Bills are coupon payments and the repayment of principal amount. By discounting these cash flows at an appropriate discount rate we can find the value of a bond. Now we have the value of share and value of bonds we can now assess the full value of the whole company. The value of the company is value of debt and value of equity. This is how we can use the discounted cash flows method to assess the value of the whole company.